What's going on everybody and welcome to the Magic Keys tutorial. This is where I'm going to be explaining how to use the Magic Keys, how to use it for risk management, how to use it to open and close trades, and a lot of other different things. What is the Magic Keys? The Magic Keys is a physical and digital risk management tool that was created by Raja Banks, formerly known as Wix Don't Lie. This tool is one of the best tools that both Peyton and I have seen when it comes to risk management and managing trades. This tool can be used on MetaTrader 4, MetaTrader 5, and CTrader. And this is what the magic tool looks like. There is both a digital and a physical form. I'd rather use the physical form because you get to actually feel and touch it while you're trading and it is really good, especially if you're a scalper. But let's go, let's dive deep into this and figure out how do you really use this. So, what are the things that the magic key can do? The magic keys can open and close your trades based on risk parameters that you preset for yourself or change before you place a trade, move your stop loss to break even at the press of a button, or preset where and when your stop loss will be moved to break even automatically. Place multiple take partial levels in advance so you don't have to take profits manually. Tracks how many trades you have taken to help avoid over trading and much more. So when we're looking at the magic keys, we have the open calculator button, open trade button, double trade button, auto break even or auto BE, Partial TP or partial take profits, stop loss at entry, target at default, target at one to whatever risk to reward ratio, zoom in and zoom out, change your symbol, close your full position, close half position, close the customized amount, change whether you are trying to be in a buy or a sell that's what you will use when you open a calculator market pending orders for buy stops and buy limit orders show your stats on a pair and the enter button is just like the open trade button we also have input risk input pips this is the calculator that your computer has on default that it'll pull up. I don't necessarily know what this number button is. Function function one and function two. And these functions are for you to customize them and have them do whatever you would like to do. We'll talk about them more. Then we have FN3, which is used to go down one time frame. And this is FN4 to go up one time frame. So for example, if I was on a one hour time frame and then I press FN3, then that would make me go down to the 30 minute time frame. And if I were to press FN4, that'll make me go back to the one hour time frame. And if I press FN4 again, it's gonna make me go on to the four hour time frame. For complete setup instructions, go to youtube.com slash watch and type in the rest of that so that you can properly install Magic Keys onto your MetaTrader 4, MetaTrader 5, or CTrader app. And that is the Magic Keys.